What are the defenses to murder in Florida? Well, once the jury finds that the defendant killed somebody, they have to look at the circumstances surrounding that killing to see whether it was excusable or there was lawful, uh, justifiable, stand your ground self-defense. So we'll start with the excusable part. If the dead guy was committing a felony, could be excusable. If the dead guy was coming into someone's house and threatened them with a gun, a knife, or otherwise, could be excusable. That could also uh, go into justifiable use of deadly force uh, under Florida's stand your ground law. So those all would be potential defenses uh, to a murder case. Now, other things that may not be necessarily defenses, you could raise to say, well, it's not first degree murder, it's not premeditated, maybe it's second degree, third degree, or maybe even manslaughter, an unintentional killing. So that would potentially reduce the sentence not necessarily a complete defense, maybe a defense as to a higher degree of a murder charge. Uh, obviously, you'd be looking at less time on a manslaughter versus obviously a uh, first degree murder. Until next time, this is Gray from graytesh.com. Remember, law is not black or white, it's gray.